In this step-by-step -step tutorial, I will show you how you can start copy trading on Hyperliquid with their Vault functionality. Hyperliquid Vaults offer an easy way to copy other traders. We can analyze their performance and pick the best traders to copy. If you don't have a Hyperliquid account yet, you can click the link below the video to create an account. Additionally, you will also find a link to a step-by-step -step tutorial if you need help with the sign-up process. In that step-by-step -step tutorial, we will show you the full process of setting up a Hyperliquid account. However, before we get started, we first must get the funds into our Perps wallet. So go back to Trade and then go to um, Perps Spot Transfer on the right-hand side and also make sure that you have USDC. At the end, we need USDC in the Perps wallet. So now on the right-hand side, click on Perps Spot Transfer. And now it right now it's set to Perps to Spot. However, we need to click on these two arrows to send funds from Spot to Perps. Now I will send everything over into my Perps wallet, confirm this, and now we can copy trade in the vault section with our USDC. First of all, there are protocol vaults, which are directly from Hyperliquid. The HLP is a market making system on Hyperliquid, which is overall very stable. Additionally, we can copy user vaults, which are just users on Hyperliquid, uh, because everybody here can just simply cl click on create vault, and then they will be in this list. Now we have a few functionalities. We can, for example, sort for the, the APR, which means annual percentage rate. So we will see who has the best or worst returns. Then we can also look for the TVL, which stands for total value locked. Um, that basically means how, how much money is in this vault. So overall, the copiers put in over $9 million into this vault. For example, in this guy, uh, people put $2.3 million. So that basically means how much money is copied from this guy. Then we can also see our own deposits. So if you have money across multiple vaults, you can sort for high to low here and low to high. And then lastly, we can look for the oldest and youngest vaults in the age section. Then on the right side, you also see a snapshot of the recent performance, which is also a very nice thing. Now let's here go with TVL. So we can see the traders on Hyperliquid with the most money copied. Let's now click on the stabilizer because he really has a nice equity curve. You can see this is relatively stable. So let's click on this. And now what we can do, we have a few options here. First of all, we can analyze his performance. For example, in the last 24 hours, in the last 30 days or all time. I usually go with all time because we want to get an overall view of this trader, not just the last couple of days. Then you can also look at the account value, how much he has in TVL, and we can see that people keep adding money into his vault. Then we can also click here on vault performance. Overall, he made over $181,000 in profit. The maximum drawdown was only 1.28%, which is very low. And he has a profit sharing ratio of 10%. Now also, if you have put money into this vault, you could see your performance here, but right now we didn't do this yet, so we can see that afterwards. Then at the bottom, we can see the balance that he has right now available. We can see the positions that he has on the Perpetual Futures platform on Hyperliquid. So these are all of the positions he has open right now. So here we can see all of the trades that he took, like opening and closing trades. Then funding history, which means he either paid or received the funding fee. And then we can see deposits and withdrawals, how much money went, went into the vault and outside of the vault again. And then we can see the depositors. Now, right now, over 100 people copy this guy. And then we can also sort here how much money they put into this vault, how much money they are currently in profit or in loss. Then we can also see the all-time PL. In this case, the biggest loser was only $54 and the highest profit was $22,000. And we can see that this is overall um, looking very reliable. So now let's put $20 into this vault. Also, please keep in mind there is a one-day lockup. So when we put 20 USDC in now, we can only get it back after 24 hours. Then we click on deposit here. And that's it. We have now deposited 20 USDC into this vault. Additionally, let's also look at the Hyperliquid Vault, the HLP, which is directly a market-making system from Hyperliquid. And we can see this is a really steady equity curve too. So let's also now put in uh, some funds into this vault. Let's put 15 USDC here, deposit. And now we have successfully initiated two copy trades on Hyperliquid with their vault functionality. If you want to cancel the copy trading, go back to the vault section in the top left corner, click on vault. And now you can here sort for your deposit high to low to uh, show all of the vaults which you're currently in with all of your money. In this case, we for example here have money with the stabilizer, click on this. And now if you want to withdraw money next to deposit, you can see the withdraw option. However, keep in mind there is a lockup period. So I personally now have to wait 24 hours until I get my money back. So 
tomorrow in 24 hours, I can uh, pull the money out in the withdraw tab, simply cl click on withdraw, and then you get the funds back on your Hyperliquid account. If you want to get started with trading on Hyperliquid, I recommend you click the link in the video description or in the first comment, because with the link, you will get a 4% discount on trading fees. If you want to get the best trading conditions, I recommend you take advantage of this offer. Below this video, you will also find links to other guides that we have made about Hyperliquid.